Greetings everyone, my name is Dr. Sunshine, and welcome back to The Last Campfire. We just reached into an area called the Pig Marsh, so where are the pigs? And are there any forlorn around here? Because we haven't seen any in a while. I mean, there was that one before we got into the elevator, but we couldn't do anything about her, so... Are we still... Oh. Oh, well we need the Lanthorn here. And I think that's our only option. Can we... Oh, we can climb up there. Uh, let's see what we can do with the Lanthorn. Oh. We can move the ladder. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh! Um... Okay, I didn't realize we'd rip the whole thing off the wall. Well, now we can go up there. Okay. This horn is super handy. Ah, these plants are so weird. Ooh. Do we, we get to go on a slide? Oh, yeah. Ember didn't mind getting muddy. The slide was such fun. <laughs> we are very muddy. Is that going to go away over time? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's push this back. Sweet. So now we can come around here. Oh, there's a pig. Hey. A sleeping pig. Trotters in the air. Aw, look at that little guy. They looked happy. Yeah, he's kicking. He's dreaming. A sleeping pig. Oh, okay. I thought I could interact with him. Ooh. Um. The plant looked like it could take a hand off. Yeah, luckily it's not doing anything right now. And it was in Ember's way. Yeah. Too bad I don't have a torch. Ah. Alright, um, I'll be back. What am I s- Oh. I'm gonna feed you whatever this is. Probably full of acid. The fruit was giving off a sickly sweet smell. Here you go. Yeah, it's real good. Um. The plant looked like it could take her, and it was in Ember's way. Yeah. Oh! Uh... <laughs> wait. Okay, what were we supposed to do then? We give it the plant, but then... Do we give it to the... No, we don't give it to the pig, do we? I hope it doesn't kill the pig. But I'm gonna try. Oh, come on, please, please. Oh. Oh, you're gonna- oh, no. Oh, no. How's this gonna play out? Oh! Ember I'd chuckled. The dangerous plant was no match for a hungry piggy. <laughs> Well, that's good. I didn't expect that to happen. I thought the, the plant was going to eat the pig or something terrible for the pig. Aw. He's all tuckered out. Yep, he's tired. Well, thanks, pig. Okay. Now what? Do we have to deal with more plants along the way? The wallow. So like that, we're out of the pig marsh? Oh, hey, it's you. Okay. You just keep being mysterious and all that. I bet I can lift that. Oh, yeah. Just gotta rip these from the ground. Come here. Just gonna roll. Oh. Perfect. Rip you out. Roll it over here. Perfect. 
It's like it was meant to be there. Oh, there's so many slides here. A hideous odor filled the air. Uh, like the music. Ooh, yeah. God, these slides are the best. Uh. And suddenly, the reason. Ah. Uh. Okay, that's a big pig. That is a really big pig. Is that a skeleton? There's, there's multiple skeletons. Have you been eating people? God, why is this stomach glowing like that? Hello? Pig inhaled a giant snort of air. Okay. Wait, what's that delicious smell? Wait, is that the pig talking? Ember shuffled nervously. Uh oh. Other embers fed me treats. Uh oh. But then stopped. You oh. me now? Um. I saw a fish down here. Can I grab the fish? Can I do anything? Oh. Wait. Wait. Yes. Come on. Nope. Is it too far now? Oh, I have to bring it over here. Okay, that makes more sense. There's a lot of area down here. Okay. Well, we gotta feed. What? The pig would eat some junk. Why is there a TV here? Why does this world have TV? That pig is not gonna eat junk. But, let's see if he does. You want a TV? Yeah? Okay, not picky. Why? What is going on in there? Surprising. A little sparky, but tingly and belly. Weird. There's something very weird going on with him. He's got like runes on his stomach. But what I want is something more fruity. Ooh, I saw one. I saw one of those. Okay. But you sit could tight. Anything. Ember just needed to find more. Here's more. You want this, right? Oh yeah, yeah. You'll eat anything. Is this pig gonna explode? Fruity, fresh, but tastes a lot like mud. Oh, okay. But what I want is something with more crunch. Huh. Um. Perhaps if Ember could satisfy the pig, they might be more helpful. Yeah, I'll I'll see what I can find that can crunch. I don't I don't know what you want. A lost message was inside. The mist is thick. One way blurs into another. Where do I end? Where does the world begin? I cannot see far enough to tell. Weird. Okay, something that will crunch. Go on. We're over there. There's more area down here. Well, let's open this. Ember found a secret note from the Wanderer. Okay. Something beckons. This place is not home. I trace the map in my head, recite the older myths. I have to move on. But why? I mean, are you trying to go to the fire that you missed out on at the beginning? That's the one thing that I'm wondering about for the overall arc of this game. Like, yeah, we're saving Forlorn and all that, but where are we headed to? Are we just trying to get to the fire? Because I don't think we're the same person that was at the beginning of the game. So what's our goal? Okay, something that will crunch. Oh, there's a Forlorn. Uh... There's something back here? Uh, 
Oh my god, there's so much area. What do you want that will crunch? Nothing here. Oh my god, how big is this? Oh wait! Ember came upon another campfire lost in the wilderness. Oh, it okay. It looked long cold, but ready to be lit. Well then, let's light it. The ghost said, speak and I will listen. Fantastic. Are you a different ghost? Probably. Where am I? This is the Hollow Marsh. Here hope was consumed before it could flourish. You must not lose hope, or you too will turn forlorn. Nah, I won't turn forlorn. Not anytime soon. Ember thought of those they loved, those they'd left behind. Um, I want to help others. There are others lost along their journey. I figured. Find them and I will guide them. Okay. Is that, that's it. Come on, help me. You gotta give me more than that. Down steps to your east, travel the path south, watching a pig grow unhappy, a forlorn lost hope. Yeah, I know about that one. Oh, come on. You're giving me information I already know about. Oh, we need four. Four is the minimum here. I think for the most part, I'm gonna just try and get the required amount so we can move on because I don't think we can always get the full amount in these areas. We keep needing to get new items and backtrack, so let's just focus on what we need to move on to the next area. Can we take this all the way back? Because this will definitely crunch. Oh yeah, okay. You ready for this? You're gonna have a frog statue. Oh, you're gonna love this. What is this? Not food. But it crunches. Bring me food. Oh, come on. Now you're getting picky? You ate a TV. You ate a TV. Ah, uh, we have to work our way around, don't we? Well, there was a skull, but is he going to say that's not food? I don't know. The skull Ooh. was disgusting. Perhaps the pig would like it. Okay, well, that answers that question. I don't know where this is going, so I'm just going to leave this here. Sweet. Okay, you want something crunchy? Well, how about some straight up bone? This was the last thing Ember could find to offer. Oh. What's gonna happen? Is he gonna explode? Crunchy. Embery. Not much meat. Bit too bony. It's basically all bone. But what I want is... Oh, come on. The pig's stomach made an almighty sound. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What the? Ember chuckled with relief at the large creature they had been so afraid of. Weird. Okay, I think that pig was cursed. I mean, that... It's kind of weird that he had, like, runes or markings on his stomach like that. Did he just roll in the water? The pig had vanished, but something moved beneath the surface. Hold on. That, that's a pig, so is he dead or...? Nope. Should have figured in he'd float. Pond, Ember thought the pig looked a lot less imposing. The pig shouted joyously. The water feels so good on the skin. Fantastic. Glad I could help. Join me, Morsel. No, I'm, I'm good. I'd rather not swim. The pig seemed happy, but Ember wasn't getting too close. 
Why do I consume whatever people put in front of me? No idea. I need some true nourishment, but there's none left here. But so much cooler in this muddy pond, I can finally think. Thank you, Morsel. You're welcome. Wait, are we gonna are we gonna use you as a bridge? Oh, probably. Maybe your eating has some deeper meaning to it. I I don't know what that meaning is, but probably some reason behind it. Ember thought about the pig. Fed to oh. bursting by others, but without nourishment. Who had the pig been before? Ember wanted. Well, that's a thought. Didn't think about what he was before. Because he, he does seem cursed. So, it's maybe to reflect whatever issues he had. I, I don't know. Hello. Cheerily, the stranger said. Don't say much, little friend, do you? No. No, not not much. Remind me of one of those golem statues. Oh, the big, like, robot-looking guys? They're pretty cool. Stood there, mouth open. I like you. Well, I mean, great. Okay. <laughs> no helpful information. Fine. Well, we got shortcuts. Do we want to go over here? There's more to the right. Hmm. We'll probably come back here because that... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I saw something. The wallow edge. Okay, hold on. We will probably come back here because the bonfire is in the center, or the campfire, I should say. Oh! How strange. Okay. Let's go check that out. Oh, come on. Oh, okay. <laughs> Didn't realize I was connected. Go up here. Ember found a lost message. The smell of hot broth and hearty stew wafts across the swamp. By the cook's pot, I meet another. They are on their own path, but we promise to meet again. Oh, that's right. There is a cook in the marsh. Is that the cook? Hmm, maybe. What's over here? Like I said, there's so much area. Ooh, a slide. Uh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go on the slide. Can't resist. Oh yeah. Oh, that's so fun. Ooh, another pig. Hello. Ember was jealous of the pig, snoring contentedly. <laughs> Oh, uh, the little fella. Oh. Sweet. Now we can slide down this way. Do we... Uh-huh. I think we might have to roll one of those, uh, the fruits down. So we probably need it to the right? I... Hmm. Let's try that. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's, hold on, let's bring this back. We're gonna lure this pig over to the left and take care of that plant. We're kinda jumping all over the place, but we don't have any set direction to go on. So, I'm just going to take care of things as I see them. Yeah! And we'll follow. Can't resist going down the slide. Sweet. Okay. No, no, no. Pick it up. Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. Yeah! Oh! Come on. 
Come on. There you go. Ah, look at him trot. Okay. Put that there. Go for it, piggy. Ember watched as the helpful piggy cleared the path. Ah, oh, thank you so much. You relax. You're gonna... <laughs> you gonna find a spot to lay down? Oh! There he goes. Alright. More notes. Inside was a scrap of journal. In the orchard, I meet the stranger from the cook's fire. A stranger no longer. Together, we fill their satchel. Food and memories for the road ahead. Huh. Weird. So... This might be a long shot, but maybe the person in the cave, or the, the skeleton in the cave that I got the satchel from, is that the same person? Nah, there's probably more than one satchel in this world, so... I might be making a, a big stretch there. I'm trying to link these together. Should turn this, though. Go back up here, take the slide down there, and we might be able to get to that forlorn that's just beneath us. Yeah, I think we will. Oh, come on. Hello. Ooh. Path of Ruin. The stranger couldn't take on more. Oh, can we, are we supposed to use? Oh, yeah. Interesting. Okay, we just gotta shift these around enough. So I'm thinking we do. This, yeah, that goes there, and then we move. Yeah, this one's easy. Wait, pretty easy. That goes, yeah, we want this up here. Oh, we're gonna have to move these again. Well, we can do it from up here. We need to make a bridge. The That's time cool. To had passed. Okay, so we put this down here. This one comes over here. I think we could walk on that, or... Let me see. Ah, uh, no. No, we need it back in the original spot. So, let's put that there, that will go there, get this one, oh, almost. There. into the soft moss and waited. Yeah, look at this. That one was pretty good. They're just challenging enough to make you think a little bit. They're not trivial, but they're not agonizingly difficult. Stranger stretch their limbs. Perhaps it is not too late after all. Nope. You got a brand new lease on life. Campfire's over there. I don't know. Actually, I can help you get over there. Just gonna push this tree down. There you go. So 
that's one. But now we need to go... Wait, how do we turn... It looked like we could turn the, the slide over here. Oh. I gotta do it from there, okay. Turn this, yeah. Now we have to go all the way around, slide down over there, and I, I don't know where it's gonna take us. Here we go. Get, get it, get in there. I can't slide. Maybe I didn't connect this all the way? Wait, can I? Oh, maybe I didn't connect it all the way. Oh! Oh, stupid. Okay. Now we slide. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, this is the best of times. The Wanderer's Diary. An ancient throne sits empty. No one remains to guide or protect, but we do not mind. My companion shelters with me now. We cannot help those left behind. Yeah, you know, I think that might have been the same person. Because, uh, the Wanderer, the one in the orange outfit from the beginning of the game, I, I'm trying to find links here. And the satchel, I mean, that might have been the same person, but how much time would have passed then? And why? Like, oh, I really hope it's as complex as I'm thinking, where there's some weird time difference that's going on from the beginning of the game to now. Because it seems like that's possible. Oh! Well then. Okay, so. We can go up here. There was more back to the right. Let's just, let's check up here, since we're in the area. The nook. Oh! That's where the cook is. Hello? The pot had turned cold. The fire had died. That's the cook, right? Oh! Okay, lost in thought. Nothing the cook made felt good enough. Endlessly stirring the same tasteless pot. Couldn't focus, sleepwalking through the days. Aimed inwards was a swirl of thoughts. In the eye of the storm, a fragile flicker. They wanted to serve something perfect. So it seems like the cook and the big pig can probably help each other out. The praise of others was hollow. Cook felt numb and hurt all at once. That was simple. It was all timing. Alright. You're gonna get back to work. I've got a hungry customer that needs your business. Oh! It's a turtle! Did not expect that. The cook spoke softly. Oh, hello, little one. I didn't see you. Yeah, you were kind of frozen in stone. I must have lost myself for a moment. Yeah. Ah, oh, you're my favorite. What are you cooking? It's supposed to be my new soup recipe. Okay. But it's not ready. It's not done. What do you need? A wonderful smell wafted towards Ember. You look starving, poor thing. Have a little taste, but it's not right yet. It was the most beautiful thing Ember had ever tasted. Ah, uh, so you're a perfectionist. 
and you just aren't confident in your own craft? I know. It's got no flavor, nothing special. No, it's perfect! I never wish the cook would believe them. Um... Are you okay? Oh, I used to love this. I just want to be good at it. You are good at it. Who told you you weren't good at this? But it feels like I'm making the same things over and over. But you've mastered it. Nothing has flavor. I'm stuck. Hmm. May I have more? Oh, I'd forgotten how good it feels feeding folk. But it's not ready. There's no need to pretend just to make me feel better. The cook stirred their soup, looking at Ember, looking at the pot, staring, thinking. Soon, maybe. Make me something? If you know what you want, I can try. But I really need some better ingredients. Ah. Something from the orchard could have worked. If it was still standing. Well, where was it? Orchard? Oh. The cooks struggle to hold back their emotions. Pigs have gotten in me orchard. Oh. Planted every sapling I did. All me hard work ruined. Take the key and have a look yourself. I can't bear to. Okay. See if anything is left. But I promise you. There won't be. Nah, I bet there'll be something. Okay. Well, cool. I, I really bet that I'll be able to help the big pig like I helped the cook. I just don't know. We probably have to make the food and then we give it to the pig. I Maybe we can do something about it. But that's all the time I got for this one, so we will continue this next time. Thank you all for stopping by. If you enjoyed what you saw, please be sure to hit that like button down below, share your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye now.